And I wish some of y'all would mess with my wife, Jordan. Talking about what you gonna do if you see her. Well, you will see me on the news. Let, let, let me just tell you that right now. Talking about what you gonna do if you see her. You better walk by and say praise the Lord. That's what you better do. Cause that's my wife. And she grown. She didn't need nobody to sign no paperwork for her. Now, if this was out in the streets, y'all be saying she made a come up. But you a hypocrite. So don't you forget the Bible say marriage is honorable. And the Bible said when you find the wife, honey, you find favor with God, honey. I found some favor with God. And we sleeping good at night. Ain't nobody up all night worrying about all these crooks. But I felt I need to say that because somebody talking about what they're going to do if they see you. I'm telling you now, don't let the devil fool you. Because I ain't the one to play when I get on the other side here. Wish you would. Yeah, uh-huh, you can be the, the, the pastor. Yeah, me. Freaky-ass pastor. Everyone out here living their best and freakiest lives. This is what y'all gotta understand about people who date young girls like that. They didn't just start dating. They have been talking way before that. Probably been speaking to her since she was 16, 17. He married her right after she turned 18. He was plotting. Where are the parents? They just gave up their daughter to an old man. He was 45 when she was born for God's sake. And I'm sure he has kids older than her. That's insane. Just because they are legal age doesn't mean she is emotionally mature for a relationship with someone who can be a grandpa. She's younger than the age gap. Think about it. She is younger than the age gap. And the crazy thing is, you have the congregation applauding this bullshit. They are really delusional. I will never understand these people who be clapping when their pastors are dead wrong. Y'all need to be booing and walking out. The parents' role in this situation is baffling. It raises serious questions about their judgment and the environment in which the young woman was raised. It is disturbing to think they might have allowed or even encouraged this relationship and it's hard to see this as anything other than a predatory situation. This is why we need to protect young people from those who might exploit their naivety and lack of life experience regardless of legal technicalities. But hey, let me know what you think in the comments down below.